Hello everyone, Dino Co Films here, and today I'm joined by my brother, Wolf Gamer. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm here. And today, we're gonna be taking a look at some Pizza Tower add ons that Wolf Gamer already looked at, so go check out his video. Yeah, um, check out my video before you check out this video. It's been giving me more views. <laughs> this guy is an addict because this guy has hit a huge milestone. He just reached 200 subscribers. So. Yeah, yeah and if any uh, Wolf Gamer fans are watching, there will be a, a thousand, uh, I mean, a 200 subscriber uh, video. Anyways, we're gonna be taking a look at some Pizza Tower NPCs and ragdolls. I saw Wolf Gamer's video, and um, well, they looked pretty awesome and actually really well done. Uh, however, there's only like five NPCs at the moment, so I really hope this add-on does get updated. Um, but I guess we shall see in due time. So um, I guess we're gonna start with um, actually looking at some ragdolls. These were made by a different uh, creator. But they, um, I think, use the same models for the um, NPCs, uh, relatively. I think they're slightly different sized. But um, So we're going to take a look at the ragdolls first, and then we're going to also look. And as you can see, we're at Pepino's Pizza. Um, someone made this uh, lovely map here. Um, it's very, you know, basic. You got this random cliffside and Pepino's Pizza on top of it. Um, but so, it is, you know, pretty nice, I would say. Um, you got the whole pizzeria here. You got some pizza, you know, kitchen. You know, it's just sort of, you know, basic, sort of random fun map. And it felt very fitting to, obviously, take a look at this add-on um, on this map. So, the first ragdoll, it seems we have the cheese slime, which is the basic, like, Goomba enemy in the game. Um, <laughs> looks rather, uh, disturbed, to say the least. Um, oh no, he's, uh, the snot man. I forgot the name of. Yeah, he's in, uh, level, uh, four. Like, yes. Um, Don't kill him. You're not supposed to. But, uh, these guys actually have, um, quite a bit of, uh, face posing capabilities. Um, which I think is kind of cool. Um, so you can actually <laughs> go to town on these guys and make them very expressive. Um, I've seen a lot of people in Gmod make, like, animations, um, in Gmod, uh, with these NPCs, so it's kind of cool, um, that they're able to use these models and make them super expressive and stuff. Um, next we have, uh, the toppings. Let me just spawn those two. Um, here's the cheese. I think he's just a prop. Let's see. No, he's a ragdoll. Um, but he's literally just the cheese. Little baby. He's the second topping you can pick up. And then they got the, the little mushroom. Um, let me just... He's a little baby. And his body groups. Oh. Running legs. And no legs. That's cursed. The, no, the cheese slimes don't have anything. Um, let me grab... Is, is that it for toppings? Oh. <laughs> we have the big... <laughs> we have the big pineapple. Oh, God. Ugh. Get that... No. <laughs> Leave now. That is cursed. Pinacool, I think is what it's called, according to... Oh, no, I just want to show you something with this guy that I, it's very disturbing. So... You can put this into your kitchen, but then as soon as you turn it around, <laughs> it's just like... <laughs> that, is, that is the worst thing I've ever seen. Ugh. <laughs> cursed. Um, speaking of cursed, here is two versions of fake Pepino. Um, they're slightly different models. Um, like a version 1 and a version 2, I'm guessing. Uh, yeah, they're by, by different um, model modelers and you can remove their head on well this one you can remove the head which is just cursed um oh no here's fake Fapino. I don't know which one I like more uh, this one has a very big head but I think that's kind of how he is oh, I can make them all goopy oh god Ugh. <laughs> oh that is cursed 
Oh my. <laughs> what the heck happened to him? He's so goopy. But no, you can actually like make them, you know, look as cursed as possible. Um, just like fake Pepino is. Um, easily one of the most disturbing characters in Pizza Tower. Um, you know, just for you know, the whole fake Pepino aspect. That reminds me of like Metroid or the, sort of the thing or something along those lines. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I just did a randomizer and then... Creature. Get this thing away from me. I'm gonna throw this one off the cliff. Goodbye. <gasps> Ooh, next we have Gustavo. Hello. <laughs> oh my god. He's such a little lad. And here's Pepino himself. <laughs> he looks completely... Irritated. <laughs> ugh, 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 ugh. There you go, there's Pepino. Looks pretty Pepino like, I'd say. Obviously, the translation from 2D to 3D doesn't always work. Um, I'd say for most of these guys, it does. Um, Pepino looks a little weird, in my opinion, but it, you know, it's. I haven't seen much other uh, 3D Pepinos. Um, that really look much different than this one. Um, who else do we have? We have Mort the chicken. <laughs> Which is, uh, you know, from a PS2 game. It makes an appearance here. Yeah, he looks like he just does not care. He does like not care. Eyes. Mr. Stick. He's a little short. He's supposed to be a little taller. Uh-oh. Put Pepino on the ground, I think. Pepino's a little either eh Stavo feels right. It's just eh, maybe Pepino's just too big. Uh this one actually has an NPC. Yeah, it's the same model. It's one of the quote unquote Five Nights at Freddy's uh animatronics. I really like that level of the game. It's just super uh, self aware and over the top. Got him, Pepperman. He has an NPC too. <laughs> what a what a face. Open the, open those eyes. Ah! Hey <laughs> oh. everybody, uh, he does make faces like that in the game. So, fair enough. <laughs> Cursed creature. Here's someone else's Pepino. Let's see. Yeah. I like that model more. There's so many Pepinos. I like this Pepino more. <laughs> I feel like it looks more like how Pepino does in the, the game. The head's a little more boxy and the, the nose shape. No, I like that one more. I just wish he was a little smaller, I think. Oh, John, or sorry, Pillar John. John Gutter. <laughs> You'll be seeing him later, too. Oh, here's Pizza Face. He's a little small. And Pepino is bigger than Pizza Face. Scale on some of these guys is a little weak. Oh. Oh. What the heck? Part of the building. There you go. Good. Perfect. Or you can do this. Ready? Get his body back. This is his place now. <laughs> hey, you can burn over there. Uh, with Pizza Face, you get the the Pizza Head, man. God, very nightmare inducing. Um, he's a fun fellow. He's definitely. <laughs> you give him his beat up, shocked expression, um, which I like. You know, a lot of these models are really good. I think it's like the size of some of them that's a little uh, not accurate. Um, oh, here we have the pizza wizard. Pizza -erd. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. This enemy is fun. Ooh. Oh, I guess that works. Now that works. That makes it look like he's got big pajamas on. His, <laughs> his robe's a little too big. Um, oh god. He added him, of course. 
the cursed beta creature. I just heard him explode. Me and Snix. Yes. Oh god. <gasps> yeah, no, I don't... This thing's kind of creepy. Purple rodent. Hey. I'm Sonic the Hedgehog. Now you're really a Sonic the Hedgehog. Got red shoes and everything. Oh god. The noise. And then we just, you know, go here. What is happening with this guy's face? I'm Sonic. You're too slow. Oh my god, what did I do to him? <laughs> yeah, I like your Sonic more. Oh, here's a... Oh. That's a... Yeah, there's a... Bigger the noise. Not to be confused with. Oh. <laughs> that is cursed. I like. I like. Uh, I kind of like this. The bigger one a little more. I feel like it looks a little better. Than this one. Oh, the vigilante. You could totally get an NPC. He would freaking be impossible to defeat, though. Wait, wait, wait. Huh, okay, well, he's not the vigilante anymore. He's, uh... Oh, he's Doe, so he doesn't... He almost looks like this guy. That cheese slime. Oh god. There you go. I used to be a one hard fighting son of a gun. <sighs> like how his boots just like collapse under him. Ah! I like the vigilante. It's one of my favorite bosses. Um, but yeah, you get a pretty large array of different characters. And then, what's this? Giant Pillar John. These are a bunch of like map models. Um, so you can build your pizza tower world. Clock. Couch. Bombs. Pillar. Janitor door. Nice. Ah! There you go. It's a tower bomb. <laughs> Perfect. Pizza boxes. More pizza boxes. I just let's think. Oh my god. Get this thing away from me. What is this? Missing texture sign. That just happened. Oh yeah, you have a lot, there's a lot of pizza power stuff that you can mess around with and make very good animations with too. <laughs> now we're gonna take a look at the actual uh, enemies and bosses, uh, NPCs. So uh, first we have the mushroom top monster from the Freddy Five Night level. Um, I think they do play the music. Uh, which you can disable here. As you can see, there's a lot of Pizza Tower uh, settings. Uh, 3D jump scares, music volume. I'm going to decrease that. Um, information about each of the different NPCs, as well as update logs. And then Pizza Time, which will be activated by Pillar John. But here we are. Here's the Mushroom Top Monster. Oh god. So he's really fast, as one would expect. And he can jump. Oh, thank god. Oh my uh, well, yeah, that was easy. Yeah, just use the shotgun and it kills him instantly. Really? How much health does he have? 1,000. That's funny. That's a, that's a nice reference or easter egg. The shotgun just yeah. kills him instantly. Um, but they do have jump scares, so I want to see that. Ow. Oh. I got the special jump scare. Oh, the Oktoberfest? Yeah. <laughs> 
They have 3D jump scares, which I think is kind of cool. I think that's a nice addition, and they're pretty well animated too. Kind of reminds me of the Five Nights at Freddy's NPC from a long time ago. This guy, oh, he like pounces towards you. So I think it's kind of cool. Let me, let me do something. Oh, Oktoberfest. <laughs> Hello, so this is the tomato monster. It still has a jump scare too. And as you can see, just like the game, it hovers. I think he got stuck. A tomato monster. I think this one's actually a little more spooky. So he just like hovers towards you. <laughs> Absolutely destroyed. I know. So we have two of the, I think there's four different animatronics, quote unquote. Um, so we have two of them, so it's kind of cool. Um, Yes, the shotgun immediately kills them, I think it's funny. Because in the game, that is exactly what happens. A very cool additions. In addition to that, you can actually... Um, never mind, did not want to do that. I wanted to possess them. Uh, just like every other Dr. Drew based um, NPC ever made in the history of history. You can possess them. So you can ruin no, your friend's no. day. There you go. Pillar John. <sighs> oh, interesting. He actually plays, yeah, the... He plays the music that, um, is in the game when you approach him. I think it's a nice touch. And, of course, uh, with Pillar John, you're supposed to, uh, kind of kill him. Oh, wow. Okay, he responds to pain. Um, but yeah, if you shoot him... Kill him. He acts like how he does in the game. And pizza time starts. Uh oh. I, I decrease the volume because um I do not want to get a copyright claim. As awesome as this music is. The Pizza Tower music is some of my favorite video game music that's released in quite some time. Um but yeah, so you can actually um, change the um amount of time. And you can actually cancel and begin pizza time just here in the options. Oh shoot. Oh my god. And well, if you fail pizza time and don't exit the level, um, the chase version of Pizza Face spawns in. As you can see, he is uh, <laughs> quite lethal. And he actually, they actually had implemented the um, losing theme. Yeah, so you can just, you know, terrorize the world. A bunch of pizza faces. Oh, it's just any time they hit you. They don't one-shot you. Which is weird. Now they're just free to roam the earth. They're coming for you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, what the? No! Oh. Run! Run! I'm, I'm, oh god, Run. oh god, I'm breaking in. Sorry for Pino. The only boss in this mod so far. I really, really hope the mod creator continues this mod pack. But, um, you know, it's made for Gary's mod and completely free. So, uh, I would completely understand if they don't uh, return. Uh, but, uh, they did great work so far. So, we shall see what comes next. Uh, here's Pepperman. Oh God! Oh wow! They have a lot of code in this guy. Not only does he have the health bar and the music, but you can also only hit him at certain times. Oh, and the drawings. And the drawings, eh? Superman drawings. Those drawings. I wonder how many moves he has. Oh God! He has his pounce and charge attack. At the very least. Freaking drawing. Oh. Oh, what? <laughs> what the heck? S rank. I got an S rank. Yeah, me too. What the heck? I didn't nice. expect that at all. What? That's yeah, so cool. You, yeah, so the more hits you get, uh, so if you're like at 10 health, you get like a C or D. So like whatever rank you like it's like the game. So like if you get let's say like 
50% of your health gone, you get like an A or a B. I see. That's actually nice. I did yeah. no idea that was gonna be here. You missed one. Drawings are also obviously an NPC, but they cannot spawn them normally. Not expect that. Getting pulled. They're doing their job. Got that charges. Oh my god, I love the animation. It's like I love the animation in the game. I mean, Translated a lot of it over pretty well into the model. Good work. Oh god. The restaurant is infested. God, it's ruthless. I got a C rank. I got a P rank. I think that's gonna wrap that up for this video, everyone. But yeah, here's all the pizza tower guys we have right now. So hopefully the we get some more one of these days. That would be very, very awesome. So, uh, all the mods that we checked or looked at today will be in the description, as well as uh, another Pizza Tower map I found uh, of John Gutter that will also be there. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, also take a look at Wolf Gamer's video if you would like, um, and subscribe to his channel um, down in the description below. And I shall see you all in the next one video or stream. Goodbye. Oh my god, there's like a million of board improvements. Oh, P-Ray. Ah! Steal your idea. I just um, also want to look at the pizza towers. And it would be great to pay off my college textbooks. <laughs> the first one is uh, 100, uh, this one's cheaper. It's only $100 per month. <laughs>